Hey guys, what's up? Welcome back to our channel. If you're new to our channel, I'm Megan and today's video is going to be a pack with me slash what I packed for Disney World. We are leaving in like a day and a half. It is Thursday night and then we are leaving Saturday at noon to go to the airport and I cannot wait. I'm so excited and I'm excited to show my outfits to you guys. This is basically our first trip together as husband and wife, but I've gone to Disney World once two years ago with my friend Daisy and then I went to Disney World in middle school for a school trip. Do I remember things? I do. Do I not remember things? I don't remember a lot of things. So I'm just that's why I'm just very very excited and I watched so many YouTube videos on vlogs, what I pack and I've learned a lot but I don't have the cute accessories or the cute ears. I do have ears but I don't have like the really really cute ears. So just bear with me but this is basically our first trip and my first trip taking cute photos and all that stuff. So I'm very excited to show you guys. If you don't follow me on Instagram, you guys should down below because we'll be posting a whole bunch on our Instagram story and Snapchat and all that stuff, but we will be vlogging as well. So stay tuned for that, but you'll see the Instagram stories first. So if you're interested down below, I have two accounts, my main account and then Magic with Meg is the account that I just made because I really do love Disney and I want to continue to go to Disney every year if we can. So I made the account and I got inspired by a whole bunch of other people, a whole bunch of other people. So we are going to hop right in. All right, so day one, we are going to Animal Kingdom. So I got this shirt from Marshalls and the shorts are from Marshalls as well, but I do not have any ears for Animal Kingdom. I plan on grabbing ears when we are there. So I will wear this shirt during the day that we're at Animal Kingdom. And then we are going to Disney Springs after to do some shopping, try some food and all that fun stuff. So I plan on switching out to that shirt. And then day two, we are heading to Hollywood Studios. So I have this cute Toy Story outfit. I don't know where my ears are from. I got them about two years ago, so I'm super sorry, but the shirt is from Kohl's. Shorts are from Marshalls as well. And me and Jake have matching Toy Story shirts. And then day three, we are heading to Magic Kingdom. I literally had like three different shirts that I wanted to wear. But I found this one on Amazon and it's oversized and it is adorable. I love it. Ariel looks just so cute. So I'll be wearing this baggy oversized shirt with some biker shorts and these ears. I wish I had red ears or something Ariel themed ears, but maybe I'll grab some at the parks. I'm not for sure yet, but I just thought it was a really cute outfit. And then the only shoes that I am bringing are the black sandals and black flip-flops. I plan on wearing the black sandals. I was gonna bring gym shoes, but I don't think they're gonna look cute with my outfit. So I'm gonna bring those shoes and flip-flops. And then we have our pajamas, some ponchos, cause I heard it's supposed to rain. I checked the weather and it is supposed to rain, unfortunately. Uh, bras, your underwear and your socks, and a swimsuit just in case we do go swimming, which I'm pretty sure that we will. Those are just our airport outfits over there. And then for Jake's outfits, uh, he's just wearing khaki shorts, but I just wanted to show you guys the shirt that he has. These are all from Kohl's, and that one is the matching one that we're gonna be wearing together. This one, the Mickey Mouse shirts are just the cutest, I can. So those are Jake's outfit. He also has some swimming trunks, socks, underwear, and all that jazz. But those are the outfits. Obviously, we have to bring masks because of the mandate. So, I'm not for sure what the policy is in Florida. I know you have to wear them, but I'm not sure if you have to wear them, like, the whole time or I don't know how that works. So, I'll have to look into that or when we arrive there, I'm just going to ask them, like, what's the deal? But I got the cute mask from Amazon as well. And then, obviously your main essentials. I have my shampoo, conditioner, mouthwash, deodorant, hair ties. I don't really ever wear makeup, but I am bringing makeup because I want to take a lot of photos. So got some makeup in there, some contact solution because I got some contacts. TMI, but I might start my period while I am in Disney. So I got my cute little menstrual cup here. If you don't know about those I'll look them up they're a lifesaver and then obviously toothbrushes toothpaste hairbrush ponytails and just some more tampons 
Um, but this little baggie is from Beer Bradley. It is super cute. I have not gone to Beer Bradley in a long time, but I believe they do have Disney themed ones, Mickey and Minnie Mouse ones. So I would love to get my hands on one, but I'm just gonna stick with this one until then. And then lastly, this is my parks bag. Obviously, I gotta fix fixed it and make sure it all fits. But I do plan on getting a pair of ears from Animal Kingdom. Maybe a shirt or a sweatshirt that's just Disney that says like Walt Disney World or something. Whole bunch of ornaments and the food we're gonna try. I don't want to spend too much, but I probably will. Oh wow. But I do want to get a lounge fly bag because this one is from Kohl's and it was $20, but I didn't want to order one because I wanted to see them in person and try them on and see which ones I like the most. I do plan on only getting one, so hopefully I stick with one. We are bringing two suitcases, but I don't know if we'll have room. But let me just show you what is in my parks bag. If I find one, this might only be for day one bag, but I watched a whole bunch of videos on what to pack, and this is what I came up with. So we have our like little essentials in here. Obviously the face mask, some Tums and amoxicillin because actually my husband Jake, he did hurt his back about a month ago at work. So we won't be able to do that many rides, but we'll still be able to do some. Um, but he's been taking amoxicillin every six to eight hours. So I had to bring amoxicillin for that reason. And then the Tums, if your belly hurts and all that stuff after rides, I don't know. They said to bring Tums, so I'm bringing Tums. And Jake's had Tums. I've never had Tums before. So, gum. There's not that much in here. I actually do need to get more. Some sunscreen. I probably won't wear any. Jake gets sunburnt very easily. I don't, but I still, you're supposed to wear sunscreen no matter what. So, I still might wear some. But this is just from TJ Maxx. Marshalls, sorry. Same thing, but TJ Maxx. And uh, some Kleenex. Just a cake. Wet ones, they say you should get these to wipe down the tables and stuff before you eat. So I grabbed that. Um, I was gonna bring hand sanitizer, but the bottles keep opening. So we are either just gonna wipe our hands with this, and I'm pretty sure they have a hand sanitizer all over the park, so not too concerned about it. Um, and then just some flushable wipes, just in case. So that is in that little pouch. Hopefully that's enough. I might have to take all this out to fit it in the bag, but I don't want to do that. We'll see. And then I have a water bottle. I think you can take a water bottle into the parks. I'm not for sure. I should have done more research, but I'm pretty sure you can. Empty water bottle. I did get this cute guy from Marshalls, but unfortunately there is a hole on top there. So I don't want to spill the water or whatever we put in here. I was just like, come on now. So this is just gonna have to stay home. So I, this is the only water bottle that we have. So I'm gonna bring this one. And then a little portable charger. Is that what they're called? Um, I normally do get these, it's so stupid because I buy them. <laughs> I buy them every time I go on a vacation or we go somewhere, but I never keep them. I always just toss them. Don't ask, but that's what I do. Uh, so yeah, I already charged him too. So he's good to go. And then a portable fan. Everyone said to bring a fan. So I got one off Amazon and it works pretty great as you can tell. And it just charges with a charger. So I need to make sure I bring extra cubes. And then we got some ponchos in, in the bag just in case. I really hope that it doesn't like pour. I can deal with the drizzle, but I can't deal with pouring rain, okay? We'll see how that goes. And then lastly, I am bringing my Polaroid camera. I do obviously have my phone, but I really love the Polaroid camera and the film because it's just, it's gonna be for memories in the end. I've taken pictures with the Polaroid camera, the film, uh, bridal shower when I did go to Disneyland of the dogs like during the holidays and stuff like that so it's just something that I really enjoy so I'm going to bring 30 sheets 30 just in case I think we will be perfect with 10 like get a picture at each park a day but I just want to be safe so I got my camera and the film the film was from Amazon 
I got this like three years ago from Target or something. This is the nine if you're curious. But that is all. Hopefully that is everything. That's all that's in the bag. Obviously phone chargers, my wallet and all that stuff, but I'll, I'll do that last minute. I think this is all good, I hope so. Toothpaste is in there, toothbrushes, everything's in there. Socks, your underwear, your outfits. I wanted to bring a blanket, but I'm not for sure about that yet. Oh, I do have a pillow for traveling, but that's in another room. So I do need to grab that. Um, and then Jake's just gonna bring his Under Armour gym shoes, black gym shoes, so they will go with all his outfits. I think that's it. I feel like that was so quick because like I said, I don't have the matching cute bags and purses, the earrings and all that stuff, but I would love to. I would love to and everyone else's outfits and the matching bags and earrings everything looked just perfect and so cute i'm jealous but i don't unfortunately have that i have ears and one back but i don't want to go crazy so hopefully all this fits so that i do have room to take stuff home so hope you guys enjoyed i'm going to put it all together and show you what it looks like after <laughs> still half of the suitcase left i put the little travel essentials in there like i said i don't know what that's supposed to go on your carry-on bag i don't know whatever if we have to take it out we'll take it out so i have so much freaking room because i'm going to be carrying that but we need all the room so that i can bring home a bag and ears and all that stuff so i'm excited because we have plenty of space so that will be it for today's video i hope you guys enjoyed thank you guys so much for watching and again stay tuned for our disney vlogs i will be doing like on our way to the airport vlog and every park vlog the disney springs i'm just i'm so excited so subscribe down below give this video a thumbs up if you enjoyed if you noticed anything that i forgot obviously phone chargers your phone your wallet and stuff like that but if i forgot forgot anything let me know. You'll have to DM me. I don't think my comments are on. Or no, they were the last two videos. So hopefully they are. But hope you guys enjoyed watching this. And we will see you guys on our way to the airport. Bye, guys.